News. All right, Vicki, and we have breaking news to tell you about in the investigation into acid attacks on several dogs, including this dog, Fergus. Someone tortured this golden retriever puppy in the Antelope Valley, and we've discovered several other animals were also found with chemical burns like that. NBC4's Robert Kovacic joins us live with new actions the county is taking because of our coverage. Robert. Uh, Colleen, just moments ago, I spoke with Supervisor Mike Antonovich. He now tells me that the L.A. County Sheriff's Department has officially launched an investigation into what happened to those dogs. And the L.A. County Board of Supervisors will now offer a $10,000 reward. This all started on Tuesday when NBC4 told you for the first time about Fergus, a 15-month-old stray golden retriever found outside a Lancaster Walmart and brought to to the shelter there in Lancaster with what appears to be some type of caustic acid burn, possibly battery acid, poured down his back. And then yesterday, as the LA County Department of Animal Care and Control confirmed to NBC4 that three other dogs with similar wounds were brought to that shelter in the last few weeks, NBC4 viewers came forward as well to tell us about dogs that had been burned by acid in the very same way in the Antelope Valley, dating as far back as 2012. There's been more than one animal turned into the Lancaster shelter. And again, we don't know if it's gang activity or some type of uh, ritualistic activity by some demented individual or individuals. So we hope the reward will wake up the public to find these individuals and report them to the Sheriff's Department. And now for the first time, we show you the growing totals of the reward now being offered. You have $10,000 offered by the L.A. County Board of Supervisors at $2,500 from PETA. And then an NBC4 viewer, the very first to step forward on Tuesday night, offering a $2,000 reward. $14,500 and still growing. Chuck and Colleen, again, so many of our viewers wanting to adopt Fergus, that 15-month-old golden retriever. I spoke with Barbara Gale, the head of the Golden Retriever Rescue of Southern California. She says they're about done with applications. They're over 250 right now. She says there may be one Fergus, but there are so many others, thousands of other four-legged friends looking for homes. Of course, lessons we learned from our Clear the Shelters campaign. Live this afternoon here in downtown Los Angeles, I'm Robert Kavasic, NBC4 News. All right, Robert, not surprising. So many people want Fergus. His story has touched so many of us. You can follow his story on our free NBCLA app. We're posting updates on his recovery and the search for the person who did this to him. Police are calling it a suspicious.